U.S. futures fell as concerns about economic risks from restrictions to control the new variant outweighed optimism about the efficacy of vaccines. U.S. contracts slipped after the S&P 500 and Nasdaq 100 extended a rally, while European stocks erased earlier gains to trade little changed. Asian shares advanced, even as China Evergrande Group and Kaiser Group Holdings Limited officially defaulted on their dollar debt. The British pound fell as Goldman Sachs Group Incorporated pushed back its forecast for a UK rate hike and business groups called for government support after Prime Minister Boris Johnson announced restrictions to curb the spread of the variant, which Bloomberg Economics estimates could cost the economy as much as £2 billion a month. The global equity rally will be tested as traders expect volatility until there's more clarity on Omicron's threat to the economy and ahead of U.S. consumer inflation numbers this week and a Federal Reserve meeting next week that may provide clues on the pace of tapering and interest rate increases. We are looking to potentially have a rise in volatility even if the market continues higher around those events next week, said Francis Stacey, Optimal Capital Portfolio Strategist, on Bloomberg Television.